What's up guys, Billy here, and today I want to share one of my favorite pieces of gear with you, which is the Pelican 0915 SD card holder. The footage that you shoot is undoubtedly one of the most important things that you carry around with you. Of course, losing a GoPro or even a drone to damage is certainly not ideal, but losing footage at times is priceless and cannot be replaced. For those not familiar with Pelican, they are a very well-respected company, making great hard cases for almost any fragile item that you own. They may be expensive, but it sure beats having to replace an item of tech that's even more expensive. Now let's begin to take a look at the case itself. The outside of the Pelican SD card holder is made of polycarbonate resin that can withstand the worst drops. Securing the holder together is a latch that is easy to open, but won't accidentally come apart when dropped. At the top we have a small hole that can be used to secure this case into a clip. This is perfect for hanging off of a backpack or even a lanyard if you wish. Jumping inside of our case, we get a look at the cutouts for our cards. In total, we can hold 12 SD cards, 6 mini SD cards, and 6 micro SD cards. This should be plenty for the average photographer or videographer. These cutouts secure the cards nicely, making them easy to pull out when you need them, while assuring that they stay put if the case is ever turned upside down. One of my favorite features about this case is the waterproof lining around the edges, adding yet another layer of protection for your precious SD cards. Another great benefit to using a case like this is organization. When you buy an SD card, it comes in a small plastic case that offers little protection. Having multiple of these lying around is just asking for one to get lost. To me, always being organized is important, and being able to see all of my SD cards at a quick glance is a huge help. Now that we've taken a look at its features, let's put this thing to the test. First, let's do a waterproof test by dunking the case in some water. To easily tell if any water has entered, I will be placing a small paper towel inside to absorb it. Now while your case may not be fully submerged in the water, and you may just accidentally have it outside in some rain or hanging off of your backpack in the rain, I wanted to put it to the most extreme test that I could to make sure that all of the water would stay out. After opening up the case, the paper towel was totally dry, proving that the waterproof lining does its job. Next, I wanted to test the rugged polycarbonate resin casing. The only extreme thing that I could think of was running it over with my car, so that's what I did. Upon examination, no physical damage was done to the integrity of the case, except for some light scratches on the back from the pavement. This thing really gets the job done when it comes to durability. For those wondering, the price of this case is $20 at most retailers like Amazon, Best Buy, and B&H Photo. Even though there may be some cheaper solutions out there, Pelican is a name that I trust and I go for the best when it comes to protecting my footage and gear. So guys, that about wraps up my review of the Pelican 0915 SD card holder. I've got to say that this is probably one of my favorite pieces of gear. I only got it a few weeks ago, and I really don't know how I was living without it before this. Uh, now, I don't want to limit the comment section just to, I guess, your favorite SD card holder. Instead, I would love to hear what your guys' favorite gear is. Obviously, someone might say the Phantom 4 or the Mavic, but I want to hear what your favorite accessory for that drone is. I know a lot of people may say ND filter, but aside from the ND filter, I've got to say that an SD card holder is where it's at. It's got to be one of my favorite pieces of gear right now. So guys, as I said, this video is coming to an end. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new around here as I have been trying to upload daily. Also, don't forget, leave me a comment down below letting me know what your favorite piece of gear is. And as always, I'll talk to you later. Peace.